Um, two markers. Kill 10 scabs on shoreline and place the last signal and mark the stuff. Oh, you're right. That's a huge, that's smart. I'm backing out for that, Sven. Perfect. I got Will's wallet for the first uh, wipe in four years, and I doubt I'll ever get collector to use it. However, um, oh, that attitude. Collector is fairly easy to get to now. Like it's just a matter of time. Like you have to be able to put the time and effort in to get all the quests done. But if you actually know your way around Tarkov, probably 150 hours, you'll be on collector. The later in the wipe, the easier it becomes. Am I going for Kappa? I'll get it on my main account. Um, I just got to kill the bosses. Like, literally, it's the only thing I have left. And one more scav in Chalet, and then it's... Um, I've got to kill every boss besides Sanitar, I think. And then I'll have it. But the boss spawn chance is 11% right now. So I'd rather just focus on hardcore and do something a bit different. I scab and going I'm gonna get rich. Five seconds into spawn suddenly bam slash dead slash WTF pestilent. <clears throat> um The answer to that is lower your expectations and change it from I'm going to get rich to I'm gonna cash up and then Literally, like, th this is how I would recommend you do your scav runs. You can do them however you want for fun, but if you're actually trying to make money, whatever map you choose, which I prefer factory, whatever map you choose, you run straight towards the extract and you just grab whatever you can along the way. You don't go, oh, I'm going to go over to this place of the map and this place of the map. No, you spawn in, you figure out which extract you're going to, and you run straight line towards it whilst looting everything you can. That's it. 
the longer you spend in your scav run, the higher risk you have of dying, and also, um, the less time you're spending on your PMC. Oh, I missed. That's a player. I'm in a shit spot here. I don't have enough painkillers to... I could run to resort. But if I... there's a very good chance I'm not going to get a CMS or painkillers in the resort. I don't really want to push this player. Fuck, this makes like FMJ. You want to live forever? Oh, I'm joking. Timing. I'm dead. I'm 100% dead. I'm going to be scavenging through resort, limping, desperately. What, what do you need to go out climbers trail? Paracord? Red rebel? Okay. Is that near Bunker? Or is it, do you reckon that's the player? We're gonna run out of pain kills again, but... There it is. Ooh, ooh. Uh-uh. Someone came out. What 
There, it's a scav. Uh, I, I don't have enough time to get into resort on this painkiller. Wave frost, thanks for the uh, three months. Load ender, thanks for 13 months. The scab hadn't has done two audio lines for no reason. I wouldn't have been looking in that direction. Oh. Well, we got five kills. That was our first death in like 12 plus raids. How did he double head tap me off one bullet? That doesn't even make sense. Or well, triple head tap me. Through one hitbox and into the other. Do you need East Triple Two Key? I have no use for it, and could you just sell? But I don't mind if you need it. You don't need it for a quest, um, but it's got lead spawns and stuff. Well, 12, <coughs> 12 of Old Street. That was. I don't think I have another blue armor. Time to tank our KD. The S performance, all right. So we're gonna use them. Good range pen sucks. Let's do that. All right, so. Good news. Space increase. Um, the good thing about that raid is we actually got a bit done. We got uh, five scav kills and one of the markers done. So <clears throat> now we're going to try and do deliver in the past, which is, um, and farming are both in, in uh, the one room. So that's this one. We also have pharmacy which we don't have the key for but we can check it out if we really want to if we can get a couple of scav kills this gives us some more rep which is nice uh, level 24 is actually the next one so if we kill rishala that's a win it's just eliminate rishala flat nothing else find a flash drive scav kills uh farming which we're gonna do and then we could do night time. I oh, know, because we need PMC kills for setup. So there, the Rishala kill. And his bodyguards. So really, it's a matter of, let's see how we go. Uh, a little bit of drank if we can. Just found a Bitcoin on my scav and I started crying and shitting IRL. <laughs> Imagine you just like, your partner comes home and you're sitting there just like, <laughs> <it's> like, <laughs> like, what's wrong? What's wrong? I've had a Bitcoin. How'd you come up with your name? I think I have a command for it. Is it still there? Uh, I need, uh, I really don't have to go back through everyone to fight to get the, uh, nah, doing it, doing it. No fear. Cause you're not hardcore. Is he shooting me? Uh, 
That's real rare. What's the pen on the performance round? It's five. Okay. Mm hmm. Okay, so press shots at big red. A good third party this. So someone went through this door, they had to have gone back to Big Red, otherwise they would have ran through me. Of the century, if I kill him, it's a play to my right, too. <sighs> I'm glad, mate. Huskies, Huskies Ninja, thanks for nine months. He could have jumped off. Players card. No way. We'll get our scav skills done at least. <sighs> I'm waiting for that player to be charging at me.
actually kill him? You fucking killed him! No, he was mine! Oh. Oh, fuck. Well, we can fight each other if you want. Yeah, fucking bring it. You're dead now, aren't you, hey? <clears throat> Sorry. Setup really brings out the anger in me, hey. It was level five? Saucy Bard, thanks for three months, dude. That was so annoying. I lit the guy up, he's coughing and splattering. Anyway, we got a kill. We got a kill. I think that was a player scan. I don't know. There's so many scans. That was a shot to there. White pig and oh, what a shot! Oh, 
But we got Operation Aquarius done in a bear kill. PRS too. No, the guy's not sussed at all, bro. He, he literally creeped around just exactly how I would have done that. Except for there was multiple angles I could have been on. That was probably the only thing. We're clearing out space. Clearing out space. How good is this? Another eight. Another eight banger. Uh, right there. I guess we can get the next level of Jaeger. We just got to get quest done. Reserve is 0.02. Not time scav kills is another 0.02. So that's 0.04. Tremor's going to be a little bit frustrating until we get a broken arm. This one's easy. It's another 0.02. And that's another 0.02. Yeah, so we can get next level Jaeger. Pretty, pretty straightforward. All right, hopefully we can get, um, we need to get a boiler side spawn, but like if we spawned at the like old gas, that'd be perfect. Is black worth keeping or should I buy GPUs for Bitcoin too? Personally, I would say it's worth keeping because you could make so much money out of it. Did you get it from colleagues part uh, three or did you find it? Cause I would, I would keep it and then I would uh, just farm it to make money. Like literally you could just go sprint in there, shove everything into an injector case, like if you went naked pistol backpack, sprint straight to there, put all the stims in your stim case, you're always going to get your lab's key card back. And then um, if you can survive the raid, obviously everything's profit after that. So five, seven backpack, pff, easy money. And the earlier in the wipe you do it, which it's still pretty early. It's what, been like three weeks. You can you can make some serious coin because most people won't have a black key card yet. That you go to labs. Um, but if you're absolutely atrocious again, if you've got the colleagues part three by now, you actually are probably somewhat decent at the game, or at least you know what you're doing. So I think you'd be able to pull off doing um, some black key card runs on labs. What I would say, do 10 runs and work out how much money you make. Buy 10 key cards, just do, do it in a, in a notepad or Excel spreadsheet. Do 10, buy 10 key cards, probably cost you like 1.7 mil or something, 1.5 mil. And then just go pistol, backpack, injector case and work out how much each run for a pistol backpack costs. Five seven is probably about 40K and backpack maybe another 30. So add 70K per run. And then, yeah, that's 700K plus 1.5-ish, 1 1.6. So you're looking at about 2.3 million to do 10 runs and just see how much money you make. I reckon if you survive, if, every time you survive and you get a mule, there's like 160K. Every time you survive and you get like SJ6, that's like 70K. Every time you survive with like, like if you found a Ledex, well, there's another 800K. I'd figure I'd ask because GPUs is 700K. Well, we don't really have time to do it because the raid's about to start, but 700K times 50, right? So it's 35 million to, to max out your Bitcoin farm. Uh, if you got max Bitcoin farm, you get two Bitcoins a day. So two times, uh, it's about what, 550K is it is uh, five point, oh, sorry, two, you get 1 million. So two times 550. So you, then it was 35 million divided by 11. It's gonna take you 32 days to get your Bitcoin farm paid off. If you, if you maxed out your level three Bitcoin farm. So I think it's definitely worth it. If you're gonna play, uh, arguably, if you're gonna play Tarkov for more than 33 days, you should max it out as quickly as possible. If you're gonna take longer than 33, like if, you, if you're gonna play for like one more week, I'd say no, or two more weeks, but 33 plus days. And then you've also got the uh, Bitcoins you can, sorry, the graphics cards you can vendor if you really wanted to, which is money straight back. if you really wanted to vendor your graphics cards. So. Yeah, I bought every graphics card for under 200K. I reckon it would have averaged about a 190.
Scania sort of this wall. But I'm stuck. Another one towards setup. I'm ages away from this guy and I'm trying to hit him with buckshot. Did he run right? I'm blind. Oh, he's on top of the thing.
Reebok coming! You can't have any rounds left now, bitch! I don't. This guy had two guns, I think. If we see any scams, I'll use the AK to get some more, uh, more ammo. Food and drink would be nice too. Ooh, a second vast is actually kind of cool. I missed the graphics card. <clears throat> okay, so. I've spent ages back here, but if I can get a shotgun scav and get a little bit more ammo, that'd be nice. This pistol. Oh no, we need we need a bolt on nuts for the grenade case craft. She didn't grab. Oh well. Nobody. armor on my throat too.
Well, space isn't an issue anymore, at least. I'm pretty happy that we got a little bit of uh, setup done, though. Another three kills. All right, what's some easy quests so I don't lose my rage at, at that? Uh, we could just go to reserve. That's a simple one. If we do it at night time, then it can work towards this task. Yep, that'll count. All right, so no rig, no backpack, I mean. I have no body armors left. Uh, do I have propane? I might be at a real barter. Cool. A rig would be nice. What if we went like this? If we still have that MP5, that'd be nice. Five, six, seven. Can't remember if I held on to any more MP5 mags. Nope. Okay, uh, I just want to check hideout real quick. Uh, nothing's crafting, so I'll turn that off. Right. This is actually a really good vendor. I remember all these, like 70k. I think 36. Eh, we'll get rid of it. Alright. Let's do this. I'm going to go under underneath. We don't have any... We've got ROSA. It's got... It's that got, um... We'll take it along. It's got... Falling cabinets in there. If we spawn up a dome. Right. Well, great spawn for us. I'm going to go a slightly longer way. There's a lot of grenade boxes in here. We could actually look for um the what's his name? The TNT. It's actually a big one. Like it'll free up space and And I gotta remember all the grenade boxes are. It's weapon crate there. You and Mike made my Saturday 1.7, 2023 in Helsinki. It was Tusker Festival, and I happened to be in Helsinki at the moment. I came rushing to the bar, where you guys were. It was awesome to see both of you guys. Keep it up, Daddy. Alright, dude. There's a player here. Thanks for coming to say good day. Hello? Man, I almost need to, like, go look it up again. But there is so many grenade box spawns in this map. I'm Batman. I am Batman. What do you think? Do I go look for the TNT? I reckon we'd find one.
I'm going to have to go through D2 now. Remember, we needed not time scabs. So I remember, but I'm pretty sure there's a grenade box here. Another one inside here. Maybe it's on the top of here. There's like 37. Um, grenade boxes in this map. Something stupid like that. Night vision, eh? Strangely enough, we could actually keep all, all this. A little bit of work, but we'll get there. Am I too heavy? 
I don't think we need the RSH12. Right, that keeps us under. Take the mag out of the MP5. Yeah. I would rather use the P90 for the next bit. Just because I probably won't keep it. But it's nice to... Right, grenade boxes. Oh, I have to get scav kills without night vision on. Can I just turn it off, or do I have to actually physically take it off? You know what? Just keep it safe. Let's do it this way. I don't really need to do any more looting. I just need to get out. And or find. Well, that's actually huge. Any fine TNT? Drink? Got nothing to drink. Weapon repair kit. Is it worth it? No. Yoik. I think that's like KSM or SMP most likely. Or it could be a PSV. Uh, loot Farmer. Glad you enjoyed it, mate. Thanks for six months. Hey, mate. Scams are the worst. Cool. That's it done. I don't know how we get through the next bit, but it's not going to be pretty. Has someone gone D2 yet? Oh, 
Oh, there's another one. I'm, I need to go prone. Go prone. Go prone. Go prone. Go prone. There was three. There was three. Two geared players, no problem. Three scars, no shot. Not possible. Not good enough. <sighs> I, I think we have to survive the um, the reserve raid to get reserve quest done. But at least, at least we've been there. I don't think we have to go back there. I mean, it's a pretty fair death, bro. The SK scabs are beamer. They're all beamers. Might as well give them an AK and rust. Might even have this done. Oh no, nah. not enough death yet. Need more death. I honestly thought this had a follow-on quest. Maybe it's this one. I think it's this one that has the follow-on quest. Righto. Hermit on Lighthouse. And I need to survive this one. Where are we up to? The lighthouse. What have we got? We've got broadcast and long road. And then obviously hermit. Why didn't that come up? Broadcast long road hermit. R B O P. That's the that's the one we don't want. We want O B. That sucks. What do we want to do next? We have 27 headshots on PMCs. It's strong. We could leave this behind and just go do one reserve raid real quick. I don't know how many mags we've got though. we we'll find them. We need one AK-12 mag for... Uh, need that one. So we have no mags. We need all those mags. I don't really want to use one mag. So then I'm using AKM. Stuff like this Bastion that is so good for gunsmith. Then pistol. Or a PM. PM. PM and a dream. <sighs> My brain's pretty frazzled, guys. We do need the PMs, yeah. But it, it's ages away. Like we're talking ages. We're level 19. So we're going up three levels. I think I might stop. Honestly. I'm getting a bit tired. And I'm going to go on eight hours, so I might call it here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you're watching on YouTube and you've gotten this far, please subscribe. Help us get to the million. And uh, yeah, really do appreciate everyone being hanging out in the live stream. If you're watching on YouTube as well, come over to the Twitch stream. Much love.